the very strange new wrinkle in the case of that missing doctor in Michigan. Talika Patrick vanished almost a month ago from the hospital where she worked. Now we're learning she may have been obsessed with a famous singer, and it apparently got so bad that the singer asked police for protection. ABC's Ty Hernandez is on the story. Good morning. Good morning, Dan. Well, Patrick's family has hired a private investigator, uh, a new one, in fact. They got rid of their old one. The new investigator, Jim Carlin, says he believes that foul play is involved with her disappearance. He says he's going to go back and talk to all the people she knows and the police. And in the end, he believes the case can be solved, but it has certainly baffled authorities this far. Just imagine that you were here with me. This morning, a bizarre twist in the case of a Michigan doctor who's been missing for almost a month. A private investigator hired by the family says we may now know who Talika Patrick was talking to in these YouTube videos, in which she is cooking, buying flowers for, and singing to. If you were here, this would be your place. A mystery man. Oh, I never could have made it. One possibility. Grammy-nominated gospel singer and pastor Marvin Sapp. Sapp says Patrick was obsessed with him, so much to the point that Sapp, seen here on Good Morning America in 2010, obtained a personal protection order against the 30-year-old psychiatrist three months before she went missing on the night of December 5th. According to court documents, Sapp alleges that he has at least 400 pages of correspondence from Patrick, that she joined his church, went to his home, contacted his children, and even referred to Sapp as her husband. Friday, Sapp released this statement to ABC News. Given these previous acts, I have taken several security measures which have included obtaining a protective order to ensure our safety. I begged her to get uh, mental help. Patrick's ex-husband, Ismael Calderon, says erratic behavior from Patrick is what started the demise of their relationship, speaking to Inside Edition. When I urged her to get help, she told me that she didn't need any help and that I was trying to destroy her career. Patrick's family was shocked when they found out about the protection order, but say it doesn't change the fact that Patrick's car was found in a ditch off I-94 with a flat tire, 100 miles from where she worked, with their car keys still inside, but no sign of the doctor. Police and FBI investigators say the evidence in this case does not necessarily point to foul play, but they are working to bring Patrick home as quickly as possible. It's really confusing. This is interesting new information, but it's unclear whether it's connected to her disappearance in any way. Yeah, or whether it's really going to help the investigation yeah. go forward. Hopefully they do find her. All right, Ty, thank you.